If you are creating an NFT collection, this video is for you. I'm going to show you how to list your NFT collection and verify it on Magic Eden step by step. Let's start directly with the process. First of all, let me show you my own NFT collection. As you can see here, this is Tilaris. This is my own NFT collection. We launched it a couple days ago. And here you can see how is the result when you list and verify your own NFT collection on Magic Eden. Okay? As you can see here, I have the Discord link, the Twitter link and my website and my own description. Everything is verified and looks really cool for investors in order to buy the NFTs. Okay, so let's start directly with the process. In this case, we just need to go to Magic Eden, Mint and Creator Dashboard. Okay, it will open a new link, creators.magiceden.io. Okay, and here we can sign up or log in with our email. I'm going to use info.smithy.io. Okay, login and we will be receiving an email. Sorry for disturbing, I just want to let you know about Staking Builder by Smithy. You can get an NFT staking for your NFT project like this in just five minutes and completely free. Staking Builder is a no-code tool that allows you to create and customize your NFT staking. You can customize the logo, you can customize the colors, the reward token and everything with our easy to use admin panel. It's completely free and you can try it now on staking.smithy.io. And here we have our email, okay? As you can see here, I can click on login and I'm in right now. Let's see. Perfect. Now we are in. As you can see here, I have my two NFT collection listed now. Tilaris Pets, Gen Zero and Tilaris, the Gen 1. Okay. And here we can do different things. Okay. But essentially we have uh, the collections. It's for listing NFT collection. We can also create a whitelist here make announcement here and different things but the main important thing here will be create a new collection okay we assume that we already have our collection minted or we want to send a pre-approval submission on magic Eden. for doing it we only need to click on create new collection and here we have the whole submission process okay we have five steps so we can start directly with it we can list on ethereum solana bitcoin in this case we are going to use solana now we need to choose who is the artist of the art in the NFT collection. In this case, I'm the author. You can also use that you have uh, the license or you are not the artist. Now we can also uh, make it automatic, okay? When we launch an NFT collection, if we launch it through Metaplex, that's depend on the launch that you are using or the developer. But anyways, almost all NFT collection are using Metaplex. And when you launch an NFT collection on Solana with Metaplex, you can list here immediately just using uh, a unique identificator your collection have. Okay, in this case, um, we, won't, we will continue, but this would work if you have this ID. If not, the result is the same, so you don't need to worry. Okay, so let's go directly with the next step. Now collection info, we need to set the collection name and the collection symbol. The symbol will be the name on the link, okay? So for example, if we go to Magic Eden and go to my collection, you will see that my collection symbol in here is Tilaris, okay? This will be the symbol. So this is the name too, so we can set it here. Collection name, let's put test, okay? I will put test. And test so we can save and process if our symbol is already taken we need to put another one so let's put uh, some numbers okay perfect save and process now we need to put the collection description here is the collection description we will put here so we can put this is a test for a YouTube video perfect so now we continue with a profile image, okay, this one. You can also blow the GIF if you want to. You will see that some collections in here, for example, Famous Fox Federation have a GIF. You can do the same or you can just upload the image as you want. In this case, let me upload, for example, with image. You should know this token if you are in Solana, okay. And here we can select if for artwork is a derivative from any other collection. There are too much collection that launch a meme of any other collection, you know, in this case we are not doing a derivative, so we continue. Now we go with category, we can select different categories, it's not really relevant right now, so just select a random one. 
And now it's important here that we can link our Twitter collection at the Discord Invite and at the website. This will be the links on, uh, for example, here. This will be the links in here. Okay, so you should put them correctly. If you link, uh, if you click on link Twitter, it will open you Twitter API and you can connect it. You can also put the Discord invitation. Okay, let's put here Smithy. Perfect. So now we will have all connections of social media set. We can continue with the next step. Perfect. Now here we have two options. Okay. This depends on which stage are you with your project. If you have not minted yet, you can select on review. This means that they will review your project and will accept it. And then after you mint, you can just upload the hash list. We will talk about it later and it will be listed automatically. Okay. The other option is that you have already minted your NFT collection and now you wanna you want it on Magic Eden, so you can select listing now. Okay, my recommendation is always to send a review, a pre-approval submission, to ensure that your collection is listed as soon as possible on Magic Eden post mint. So in this case, let's select review. The result is the same. Okay, uh, so if you select review. We can select the total supply and we can set an estimated an estimated dead date, okay? But anyways, uh, this could be the process for a review. If you are listing now, you need to set the total supply. Let's put 300, for example. And here you need to upload the NFT hash list. This is important, okay? Basically, a hash list is a list of unique identificators of, your, of the NFTs in the collection, okay? So each time someone mint an NFT on your collection, you will have a new hash. So if your collection supply is 300, you will have 300 hashes in the list. So as you can see here, we should have the same number of hashes that supply. So now the question is, how do I get my hash list? Okay, in this case, I will leave you the, the link in the description of this tool. Okay, this is a tool we made. It's completely free and you can get your own NFT hash list in just one, two minutes without coding for sure. So you just need to open Phantom Wallet or Soulflare or any other wallet you have, open the NFTs and in here you can open the NFT, one NFT of the collection, click here and view on Soulscan. Okay, now we will be seeing our NFT in Soulscan with all the information and we need to open this drop down here which says creators and we need to select the first address with a 0% royalty, okay? We click on it and this is the creator address we are looking for, okay? So we copy and we need to paste it here. Paste and we click on get hash list. It will take 30 seconds, one minute, two minutes, depends on your NFT collection size. So let's wait a bit. Perfect. Now we have here success, hash list successfully download and here we have our hash list. We can open it and this is the hash list we were looking for. Okay. We can copy the whole list and we go back to Magic Eden. Here we can paste and as you can see here we have now 333 supply and 333 hash. So we click on review and we will finish the application. They will let us know the summary of the collection. Perfect. And here we can review that everything is okay. We can add any message, but not needed. And we click on submit and we are ready. Now we have all submitted for approval directly. So as you can see here, we have now the collection on submissions. If we have done a pre-approval, if they approve the collection, we will be on review with, okay? Uh, if they reject the collection, we will be on rejected. And once we are here in review with, if we made a pre-approval, we can add the hash list and it will be on listed and it will be on Magic Eden for sure, okay? If we have done a submission with the hash list with everything ready, if they approve, we will be directly listed, okay? 
So now that we have our NFT collection listed, it's time to make marketing, create a community, provide utility, and make as much noise as possible in order to get too much volume. Okay, so that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next one. Bye bye.